Hey guys, Trent here coming at you with another video. So uh, it's actually Thanksgiving. Uh, I'm going to show you a recap of sales and a few items processing for this week. But, uh, you know, it's Thanksgiving and it's a lot of rain right now in San Diego. So video production is slowing down, but I hope you enjoy. So if you're new to my channel, welcome in. My name is Trent. I'm a part-time reseller on eBay. I do it for fun and profit, and I take you along for the journey. So please hit that subscribe button for great videos in the future. So yeah, eBay's still going good. Uh, I still got plenty of items to source. I'm going to show you some of the items I'm processing. Uh, Poshmark still haven't made a sale. I haven't really put a lot of new clothing items. I'm about at 10 listings still with Poshmark. Um, I still share the listings every once in a while, and uh, you know people do like hearts on it and all that stuff, but that's about it. But, you know, you get out of it whatever you put into it, I, I suppose. But it doesn't matter because uh, eBay, there's no shortage of uh, people making offers and uh, buying my items. Uh, so we'll just stick with that, and I'm, I'm perfectly fine with that. Probably starting next week, you know, with my videos, I'm going to start get, amp, ramping up my production. Uh, send me any uh, questions you have. Uh, if it's a good enough question, we can make a video about it, you know, and help everybody and uh, gives me uh, a good topic to make a video on. So uh, appreciate your comments and everything. All right. I sold this uh, Lakeshore addition machine. It's a little plastic uh, adding machine. Uh, I usually have good luck with these when I find them, usually find them for cheap and sell them for 20 ish dollars. This one sold for $20 and 20, $20 and 12 cents. The way this works is they're all, they're all in the down position like this. So nine plus one is 10. You push it to see the answer. See, uh, the answer is 10. So all these should be pushed down. But uh, anyways, not a bad little sale. All right, I sold some more Rockenbach. Uh, all these platform pieces. Uh, this bundle of platform pieces sold for $36.81. So the Rockenbach has proven to be uh, definitely worth my right under $40 investment. <laughs> All right, sold this Nerf lot. It was the uh, Demolisher 2-in-1 blaster with the uh, Strife blaster, three magazines. I think this is a, more, a desired blaster, the Nerf Strife. This is a more expensive one, so that made the lot pretty nice. Lot sold for $45.97. All right, I sold this DVD that I had from a just a DVD lot I bought a long time ago, the Four Brothers. Uh, I put my whole store on sale, and so, of course, whenever you do that, buyers will definitely find the items that you will barely make any money or lose money on because you're, you know, I didn't, I wasn't careful when I put my whole store on sale. So this sold for $3.67, free shipping, so I'll probably actually just, yeah, I probably won't actually make money on it. That's okay. I just didn't, I just put everything on sale, so whatever. All right, sold uh, another one of those Panasonic phones that I made the video on. Uh, this turned out to be a really good model. Uh, these keep selling for the full price, asking price most of the time. Twenty-seven fifty-eight total. These sold for. This one sold for. So that includes uh, that includes a, a dollar something in sales tax in this case. But uh, so yeah, great uh, phone set to sell. All right, I sold those uh, soda dispenser little uh bottles with the uh soda king supercharger cartridges uh got these for th this whole everything for three dollars at a uh that church thrift store that i usually find pretty decent stuff at sold that uh what was that that writing dvd for like 60 70 bucks as well pretty pretty good finds so these soda this soda stuff all sold for thirty dollars and 33 cents so that's a pretty good one Here's a pretty good one. This is a Panasonic Universal DVD VCR TVD TVD DVD VCR TV Universal Remote Panasonic. Um, this one sold for seventeen dollars and forty cents. Pretty good one. All right, here's another uh, Croft and Barrow jacket I got from Goodwill Auction. Won it for ten dollars opening bid. Got it for myself and didn't like how this one fits. I finally got another jacket that I liked the most. Um, so I sold this one. Uh, this one sold for $57.88, so not bad with these jackets, getting them for only $10 bid on Goodwill Auction. It's a good uh, good item to source. Okay, and I'm making a, I made another uh, rock and box sale. These are the uh, half circle pieces. Uh, I think 27 of them. Uh, these sold for $36.38. Rock and Bach is doing well. 
All right, and I sold this uh, Pantel, that weird outdoor TV Pantel remote that has no battery cover. I opened it up. You have to unscrew the whole back face, and there's a battery inside that you have to replace. It's one of those little disc batteries. Model WR450. This actually ended up being a good one. It sold pretty quick. Somebody sent me an offer of $25, so it came out to a total price of $30.66. So, yep, remotes, baby. All right, working on processing some items. I got some phones here. I got a little VTEC phone set here. I'm charging up to make sure it works. And then I got a Panasonic handset here that goes with this phone unit here. And another handset right here charging. So I'm gonna work on those two sets. Then I unbagged this Panasonic phone set. None of these have batteries. So I'll take some of the batteries from other sets I have right now just to test this as well and clean it up and sell it as units without batteries. Then I think I'm going to clean up these uh, Gatorade G Series. I don't know if I showed you guys these, these Gatorade G Series uh, water bottle holders. Got two of these. They were $5.95 a piece. Uh, but these look like they sell for pretty good money, like over $20 a piece. So I'm going to see if I can sell them both together for maybe like a $40 sale or something. So I'll clean these up a little bit. Storming hard on Thanksgiving. Hang on, chickens. Hang on, guys. All right, I had a lot of Nerf Mega blasters before, so I took this one out of it because it's different. It's only a single shot. But these are all Nerf uh, Cyclone shocks uh, that shoot six darts, hold six darts at a time. And so Nerf Mega, in case you don't know, this is a regular Nerf dart. A Nerf Mega dart is this one. And these things shoot with some freaking thunder on them. Uh, so maybe some older kids would like to blast each other with these. Uh, so I got six of them. Average price I paid for each one was about, we'll say $2.50. So I'm going to turn this into a lot of six uh, and take down the lot of, I think I had, I had a lot before of just three of these and then that one single shot. So I'm going to try to beef up the lot and make a more enticing sale so sort of a party pack no darts included but uh we'll try it like this and see if i can make a decent sale so happy thanksgiving everybody i hope you enjoyed the video uh, please like comment and subscribe and have a good day